Hello from Fanta BH, new video and today it's about uh, Lenovo desktop computers and what happen if you try to use custom power supplies with it. So if you're interested to see all, stay with me and watch till end. It's short video, believe me. First we gonna see what we got in this Lenovo desktop computer. It is one of the latest Lenovo desktop computers uh, which have a small power supply with uh, 10 pins connector. In what we're going to see it's uh, how Lenovo desktop computer originally power on when you press uh, button at front panel. You see a uh, cooling fan uh, spinning so this machine is uh, powered on at the moment but uh, what I'm going to show you it's uh, what is voltage on green wire when this uh, desktop machine is off and if you don't know uh, green wire is uh, actually power on wire which coming from uh, every power supply in desktop machines. So if you didn't know as well, if you short green wire to the ground, you can you will power on machine without pressing button. So that means if you pull out uh, desk, desktop power supply and uh, just short uh, green wire to the ground, you will power on power supply without uh, computer. So let's see. What is voltage on green wire uh, when uh, machine is powered off and that is important. So we got here 12 volts. From this we know that uh, Lenovo using uh, 12 volt volts as standby voltage for uh, triggering power on on their machines. So here we got uh, some custom machine with uh, usual power supply with uh, 24 or 28 pins at output and I'm going to show you what is voltage on every other power supply in the world in desktop computers and here we have 5 volts as standby power supply. You see minus 5 volts it's not it's plus 5 volts uh, I just uh, re replaced black and red I just replaced uh, black and red multimeter probes and placed uh, red probe to the black wire so that is why you see minus believe me it's plus 5 volts and when you power on machine it will go to the zero so that is main reason why you can't use uh, custom power supplies in uh, Lenovo desktop computers. If you show interests uh, in knowing how to go around this problem, I can show you and that can be one of the next videos. So just thumbs up this video, subscribe to my channel and comment down if you want to see how to go around this problem. Thank you for watching and see you soon with next video.